No, I, I hardly ever write songs. I think that somehow I have a, seem to have a reputation as a songwriter, whereas in fact I've written 37 songs in 19 years, which is about two songs a year. I don't really call that a large output. I've appeared somewhat slightly on television in the United States. They don't allow me on during the uh, hours when anybody might be listening, but late at night uh, I, I've been on quite a bit. Why? Well, they're very sensitive uh, on American television. It's all commercial, as you know, and uh, the sponsors are very much concerned that somebody will be made angry, and they're, very, they're concerned at all costs to avoid controversy. They won't have anybody on who's controversial. The tunes are original, but they are supposed to be in the style of uh, various types of songs, and so they're supposed to have a certain reminiscent quality, although in fact they, they are original. I certainly am. I never realized that, uh, that it would, this would happen, or that certainly that, that uh, anybody in, in Norway, for example, would, would have heard of them. But that's turned out to be the case. Now that I have never been able to figure out. I, I suppose everybody has his own problems, and uh, some people's problem is that they like this kind of song. Maybe there's just uh, very little like it around. There's certainly in the United States, uh, there isn't much of this available. When there's nothing left to sell, selling out. I'd rather call it compromise. Is easy to do. Sometimes you have to close your eyes. It's not so hard. Being rich is no disgrace. To find a buyer for you. Who Put on your shoes and join the race. Oh, when money talks, it has a very soothing voice. You're under its spell. It's up to you to make the choice. Ah, but what Before do you, you have know it, when there's be nothing, nothing left to sell? sell.